bye bye. OG, get high, high, high. Lie detected, don't lie, lie, lie. What up, what up? It's Spencer Gray, aka Sneak Light Spence, and I'm back into another review and unboxing. This one we have a very special unboxing. First off, shout out to the Sneakers app. Um, I ordered these Jordan 18s and they gave me this bag. I'm not sure what exactly goes in this bag. It's about the size of my hand on the width or whatever. I'm not sure what goes in that, but it's a pretty cool thing. It's, it's an unexpected gift. I guess I order from them pretty often. Maybe it's because I order from them a lot. I don't know. I, or maybe everybody got them anyway. So yes, we have here the Air Jordan 18 Gym Red, aka Toro 18s. Pretty, pretty dope shoe, man. Pretty dope shoe. Um, let me check out this other one real quick. All right, so retail price on this shoe is $225. This shoe is crazy, man. It looks way better in person than I thought it would look. Um, the detail on the Air Jordan 18 is, 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 is amazing in my opinion. I think they put a lot of time into this shoe and that's something that we don't really get nowadays in newer shoes and all, all the like newer basketball shoes nowadays. And you know, a while ago, you know, we used to get the good quality. Now this shoe is not as light as some of the other basketball shoes now in modern day, but they are a really nice basketball shoe. And I'm actually told that this is a really good basketball shoe to play in. And it's not just looks. Now, if you do not know about the Jordan 18, this is the last Jordan that Jordan himself actually played in not this colorway, but this number and they dropped a quite a few different kinds of Jordan 18 they dropped some SEs and lows and all kind of colorways and those as well so first off um the detail I'm gonna try to go through as much detail as possible with you guys so on the front you have that symbol there and on the side you have well the whole shoe basically is really nice red suede. You have your Jordan logo on the front right there. You have your carbon fiber lookalike siding right here with like the zoom areas in. And also back here, you have a little bit of your carbon fiber that wrap around the hill area. And also that bumper type thing on the hill. Now this shoe was inspired by a race car driving shoe. And also the shoe was inspired by the Lamborghini. That's why you have these flaps right here. So it's supposed to be inspired by the Lamborghini in some kind of way. And last and foremost, uh, people say this is inspired by like the Bulls and all that kind of stuff. And I don't think so. I think this shoe was inspired more so of the Ray Allen Christmas PEs. I'll show you some pictures of those. And I think um, really the only difference between those is the bottom of this is black and the other one is green. And the other one has Ray Allen and this one doesn't. So I think that's pretty much the most, most of the inspiration behind this shoe. And I mean, this this is a crazy dope shoe. This is hands down so far my favorite pickup of 2018. You have your chrome so. tips on the shoe strings, and also you have your red cover there with the Jordan logo on it, and your magnetic um, button here. Now, also there are like there's leather piping that goes through the shoe. It's kind of cool. It's, it's a nice little addition, in my opinion. It has leather piping. That's kind of cool, man. It's kind of cool. So um, when you take the the pieces out for the shoe, you have a... Um, I said this right here. Hopefully it don't fall. You have your insole. Now, the insole has carbon fiber on it. Now, the you know, the carbon fiber on the on the insole is supposed to be for not only stability but jordan believed that carbon fiber helped you jump higher now that's what i'm also told about the carbon fiber and why it's in there um make sure you got your serial number in there and yeah. cool on the bottom you have your translucent bottom down there with your uh red grip or the red bottom, I don't, I don't know what you want to call it. <laughs> Flame me in the comments if you want, man. <laughs> the red grip on the bottom of the shoe. And that's actually stitched in. That's kind of cool, man. I think the whole shoe is cool in my opinion. All except for, you know, when you, like, bird's eye view, this shoe does look kind of funny. I'm not going to lie, it does look kind of funny. But comfort, it is crazy. Now, this shoe, in my opinion, runs true to size. It is a bit wide. 
but I think it still runs true to size. I wouldn't go up or down. I would definitely stay with your size so you feel as comfortable as possible. So, um, this is Spence the Great, man, a.k.a. Sneak Life Spence. Is this a cop? Is this a not? You tell me. This is the Toro Air Jordan 18, a.k.a. Jim Red. I'm going to hit y'all with that off of you so you guys let me know what you guys think about that. Until next time, it's your boy Spencer Gray, a.k.a. Sneak Life Spence, and I'll be back at you guys with more sneaker news and reviews later. Peace. Check that shoe out. <laughs>